It's, it's fairly obvious I'm a fall girl, right? I, I hope that is the first thing that comes across to anybody that I meet, that I am a fall girl. So this is my time. After September 1st, it is my time to shine. It is when my soul comes alive and fall is when I truly feel the most myself and the most at peace. It's the cozy autumnal drinks. It's the, the perfect time to watch some Gilmore Girls. The decor and it's there's just so much to it that I love. So we are going to be doing some fall shopping today. I'm so excited. I have a little bit of stuff from my last place, but I also just have so many things in mind that I want. And because we have so much more space in this apartment, we have a lot of space to fill and a lot of fall to explode into the house. Okay, <laughs> your girl is gonna buy a lot. Okay, your girl is gonna buy a lot of things for the fall because this is the one season that I do that for. <laughs> Let's go. I'm gonna get some Starbucks before we go though, because what is fall without a little fall Starbucks drink, right? So let's go. I totally forget that I don't live in Northern California anymore. It's cold all the time. I always have to wear a jacket outside. I forget that. I've been here for like two months. Ay, yeah, yeah, you guys. While I look for a Starbucks, here's my plan for stores that I wanna go to for fall items. Obviously Target, Michaels, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and then World Market. World Market, TJ Maxx, and Target today. Hey Google, take me to Target. Okay, Target. Here we go. Okay, but what's y'all's like favorite, favorite part of fall? I think mine is a tie between like actually decorating and the like treats, like the drinks and the pastries and stuff like that. I wanna hear yours though, I wanna hear yours. Now that the apple crisp drink is secured, we can explore. The first thing I'm seeing is this craft section. I found some paints for painting candles, like little pumpkins and ghosts and stuff. How cute would that be? And then this embroidery kit, are you kidding me? The best part, this knitting kit. This knitting kit, perfect. Exactly what I want. Thank you, thank you, yes, yes, in the cart. It's so funny sometimes to see the random crap they have for fall. Like what is, I've never seen this soap at Target. What is this? <laughs> Put anything out for fall, I guess, I don't know. It's cute though. But the food aisles are where I really get excited. Okay, these mini wheats are my favorite every year. These and the pumpkin spice Cheerios in the cart every time. And then the creamers, they finally started coming out with non-dairy creamer, pumpkin spice latte, and I'm so excited. I, oh my God, I'm so excited. But I will ignore my lactose intolerance for a little pumpkin spice creamer, okay? Putting that on the record. These treats, these pumpkin fall treats. I, it was hard to pick, but I picked the mini cupcakes because they were cute and no other reason. Okay, besties, time to pick a, a, a what, are they, what the hell are these called? What are these called? <laughs> what are they? Um, oh my God. Wreath. Time to pick a wreath. Time to pick a wreath. <laughs> I went for the more neutral one. Okay. Neutral always. This aisle was giving like, I don't know. Oh, filler. That's fun. It wasn't, it wasn't giving the fall that I wanted it to give, but it was still fun. It was cute. Look at these little dried leaves. Fun candles that smelled like a little bit like dirt. Um, but that's okay. I didn't, is cute and then they had a pumpkin spice candle but i didn't get it and this was the fall aisle i was waiting for i was waiting all day for this okay look at these candles look at that garland i know what that's called the mushroom acorn things are you kidding i didn't have a bowl to put that in so i didn't get it but then i went home and i saw that i did have a bowl so i should go back and get that i did put this garland in my cart but i didn't actually end up getting it because they have cheaper ones at michael's and i remembered that these glass pumpkins almost took my entire bank account almost wiped it clean out okay i wanted like 10 of these i ended up only getting two that's me being responsible okay this i had my eye on since like two days ago when i went to target and i was just hoping that they didn't sell out and they didn't i was so happy they had these last year and oh my god i was so excited that they had more this year this is probably my favorite find of the entire day the entire day they had like nothing over here it was like they were just stocking all the fall stuff in this area like look at there's it's so sparse but that little pumpkin truck are you kidding me i almost cried the kitchenware is always so cute but it's never anything functional or something Thing that I personally would actually use so I never end up getting anything but I still like to look at it because who doesn't it's mainly the mugs the mugs are just so precious look at this look at the little pumpkins oh my god I don't need a single mug for the rest of my life like I have too many but I had to, I had to talk myself down from these so hard I literally put this in my cart and then took it out later because I didn't need it I don't need it you guys 
I promise. There were so many cute tablecloths and we have a circular dining table and they never have circular dining tablecloths, but they had some, but I just didn't like them. And I was really sad. I was kind of trying to convince myself to like them and I just didn't. And then I saw that they had these cute checkered ones and then I wanted to riot. I wanted to send a corporate uh, uh, complaint to Target HQ that they didn't put these in round versions. Like how cute are they? But it's fine, it's fine. I did some magazine therapy. I got the Southern Living little fall recipe. How cute is this? I love it. Okay, quick recap. We got this little, little, little plant guy. We got the wreath, wreath. We got this little ceramic pumpkin candle. I put that back, I didn't need it. Little LED pumpkin, the cute little pumpkin muffins cupcakes. They're cupcakes. And the glass pumpkins and the crafts, and I put the rest back. Okay, Target has some good stuff. I had to put some stuff back because I'm like, I'm going too crazy. Like, I don't need, I really don't need all of this. I forgot there's also a Marshalls here. So a TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I don't usually go too crazy at these for fall. They tend to have like stuff that's geared towards like older generations a little bit. But sometimes they have some fun. They have some finds, so I'm hoping to find at least a couple. I'm gonna try and be kind of quick, but <laughs> girl, come on. Okay, let's go. Hey y'all, before we get into any more shopping, I wanna tell you about Native. Native knows what they're doing when it comes to scents. Oh my God, they're so fresh, they're so clean, they're so unique, such unique pairings. Oh, I just love them. And lucky for us, they have a best sellers pack, so it's their deodorant, it's their body wash, and it's their Dio and body spray, all mixed together in one pack. So here's the classic Dio. It provides up to 72 hours of odor protection, which we We've talked about before. I often need that, okay? I often need it. The aloe and green tea scent is so fresh. It's like the freshest deodorant scent I've smelled, period. Body wash is new for me and I have been loving it. And there's citric acid for pH balance to keep your skin ultra happy. When a body wash is pH balanced, it just sets me right for the whole day. I'm smelling good. I love it. Okay, and this is the coconut and vanilla scent, which Oh my gosh. Perfect for cozy fall time. It's just like a warm hug. It's a warm hug. And last, the deodorant and body spray, which is such a genius product. So this puppy doubles as an all over fragrance spray. This is the sweet peach and nectar scent. And it is just so yummy. You walk by and it's like, were you baking a pie, but like also doing laundry? You know what I mean? It's just so lovely. So y'all, if you want your little best sellers pack, you can get it today. It's normally $36. But if you use my link or my code, it's Cozy K, you can get your deodorant, your body wash, and your deodorant body spray, all for only $24. Ah! That is 33% off, just so you know. All right, y'all, back to some fall shopping. Thank you, Native. It's Marshall's time. It's Marshall's time. I'm so excited. I love Marshall's. Okay, these right off the bat, very cute, but also just very much very a lot these essential oils oh my god everything i want in essential oil but i can't really do them because my kitties little body scrubs fall body scrubs i love them i'm a sucker for them the pumpkin mask hello kitty mask pumpkin hello kitty mask i got it you already know i had to okay in the cart this is a celebrity spotting and no one can tell me it's not cookie monster fuzzy cookie monster pj pants i've never seen them in the wild i try not to be a hater i really do but sometimes i'm just a hater to my core and i can't i can't help it okay ray dunn brings out the worst hand soap we know it's fall y'all enough enough but then i also like the stupidest crap okay so i really can't be one to judge this hemp's lotion fire this is where i'm a hypocrite because i love this taboo list i love it suddenly i have to write a grocery shopping list for my non-existent children's trunk or treat event um and that's why i need this i i don't know what to tell you but i was good i didn't get it okay but i did come across this aisle of darling oh my god darling fall stuff this is when i had to go get a basket because i realized i'm in trouble i'm in danger i got some cups i got some more cups i got a little pumpkin dish casserole dish i'll never use i fell to my knees in this marshall's okay this crochet kit with the mushroom are you kidding me this little punch embroidery kit they had all the fall cozy hobbies the exact pumpkin smattering of pumpkins medley of pumpkins that i want autumn harvest puzzle Please, oh my God, in the cart immediately. I was freaking out, y'all. I literally, I was not well, okay? I got so excited about this little garland that I literally dropped a bowl. <laughs> I had to get out of the aisle. I got, I got the hell out of there. I just beeline to whatever, <laughs> whatever aisle was next to this one. And I was like, ooh, this mushroom. Yeah, I might use it. I wasn't, I don't need this. I just really was focusing on it so no one would pay attention to me. House mats, what are these called? Entryway mats, entry mats doormats i feel like they don't have a common there's no common word for this okay whatever doormat there was a pumpkin one it's so cute it's so cute but i just i wasn't ready i'm not ready for halloween so i didn't get it this candle however i absolutely did get i just want it for decoration no words for this no words for this no words 
for this in the cart. Y'all would be surprised that I did not get this mushroom blanket. I saw it, I was like, this is so me. This is something y'all would DM me pictures of and y'all have, and I love it. And be like, Kennedy, you have to go get this, but I don't need it and I don't need this. Okay, let's do a recap. Okay, I got this little dress. I thought it'd be perfect for fall, like Thanksgiving or something. It's cute. This is the little washcloth. I got these two cups. Then I got some of the little craft stuff back there. This face that kind of looks like the one from Target, but a little different than pumpkin casserole dish. And then down here, more crafts, more puzzles, things like that. And then I got a little basket for my washcloths. And and the garland. Y'all, I think I need to end this early. <laughs> I think I need to end this early. Marshall's got me, y'all, Marshall's got me. Because why do you have so many cute things, actually? Why was Marshall's like almost the best of all of them? They got me with the crafts, that's what it was. They got me with the crafts. It was like every single craft that I wanted to do. It was like every craft that I talked about in my like fall crafts and hobbies ideas. They were like, oh, you wanted to do that? Here you go, here you go friend, here you go bestie. Are you kidding me? Like I've never even seen felting kits at TJ Maxx before and they just had a fall felting kit. Like, ah, it was just everything. Oh my God, that was fantastic. Also, no one was in Marshall's. Marshall's was like dead. The line, there was no line. Everything was so, so super stocked because nobody was in Marshalls. I went to TJ Maxx after, which is in the same exact like shopping center and it was packed. The line was long, like things were combed through. And I just, I wonder if it's cause like the area I'm in, people are like, I won't go to Marshalls, but I'll go to TJ Maxx. Like I always kind of see Marshalls and TJ Maxx on the same level and TJ Maxx just has some like expensive designer stuff sometimes. But I guess that's how other people see it cause no one was at Marshalls. Worked out for me though, I got all the cute stuff. TJ Maxx, I, there wasn't actually that much there and I really didn't need much after going to Marshalls and Target. I was gonna go to the world market today, but I'm not gonna do that. Instead, we're gonna go back and I'm gonna explain everything that I got before today. So everything I got in the mail and stuff. Yeah. I'm so excited, let's go. I am home and this is what we're working with, okay? This is what we're working with. That is all stuff I got from the garage, okay? This is everything we got today. And this is all the stuff from Michael's and elsewhere. Okay, so this is everything I had from prior Halloweens. It's really not that much. So we have these, which I got from Home Goods or TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I don't know, but it came in a pack of three. I actually saw one similar to it at TJ Maxx today, but they were maple leaves. And I was like, they're cute, but I already have these. These are so cute. They're like little boucle pumpkins. I think Pottery Barn was the first to do it, but theirs are like $80 or something stupid. And these are from Amazon and I'll have them linked and stuff. I love the Amazon ones because they are like, this is like 12, $12.99 I think and like maybe 20 bucks. So I have that up there for now. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it there. And then I just have two of these, which are just like sunflowery garlands more fall based than like Halloween-y. Um, I usually put those on my setup, but I don't think I'm gonna do that this fall. And then I have more garland. I have these little um, felted garlands that I got from Target last year. Definitely keeping, hanging up. I don't know where, but definitely hanging up. And I have these little ghost ones. I have this. And then I have random little mini pumpkin guys. I have this, I have that. I have that ceramic pumpkin, I have that. I have this felt pumpkin. I have this pumpkin mug. I have this, which is another one of the garlands. Oh, and that white pumpkin. I just put the new garland door garland wreath. It's a wreath. I just put the new wreath up on the door. Really cute. Isn't it so cute? It like fits perfectly over a little window. I'll run you through what I got at TJ Maxx. I got this little guy, is he cute? Oh my God, I love him. Okay, and then I got this. This is more for Halloween than it is for fall, but isn't that so cute? It's the same like kind of felty material. It's so cute. I don't have a lot of like Halloween, Halloween decorations. Um, and then I got these, which are like little pumpkin candle holders and then the candles, which I think I'm gonna paint these candles. That's everything from today. So first thing first is these, which I'm actually still glad I got these. I got just in case that they sold out of that like cute Target thing. So I'm still glad I got these because I can put them in little areas also. Ooh. Then I got this fall blanket. It's plaid in fall colors. I like it a lot. I got this after I got this because this is a little more like very Halloween-y with the black hats. Oh, I don't think I showed this. This is from Cider and it's just like a little black hat, like tapestry style blanket. I'm obsessed with it. How cute. 
Oh my god, cider popped off. Did I already say this is from Amazon? Amazon. We got these like fall themed straws. This is probably the dumbest thing I got, honestly, but this was like one of the first fall things I got and I was just feeling it. But they're these like straws. They're folly. I don't know, you guys. I don't know. They're really cute. <laughs> There's like a pumpkin, there's a maple leaf, there's a maple leaf and a little like pumpkin truck situation, or a, not a maple leaf, an acorn. Why did I get these? I don't know. I thought there was one of each. There's not one of each. Should have just stuck with these. They're just like really cute brown striped. It looks like chevron. They're not, they're like striped. These are perfect for fall. I don't know why I got... Okay. Next, I got a pack of those hats that like hang up, you hang them on the ceiling. So I think I'm going to do them throughout the hallway so that like when you open the door, you see them throughout the hallway. But again, I don't think I'm going to do that till like October 1st-ish. Pumpkin. I got like multiple fake pumpkins. I both want to have them for like content stuff and staging and I want to have them on my um, front porch like going up the stairs not porch like front entryway like I said multiple pumpkins this one's really interesting this one's so cute look at that oh my god um, I got these like miniature decorations because y'all know I love mini food this is mainly just to add to my like food collection I got LED maple like candles little like vase Oh my god, I forgot about this. I forgot about this. It's a freaking basket. Oh, they put stuff in it. That's so funny. It's a basket. How cute is that? Like to have little pumpkins next to for just decor. But also, I can literally use this basket any season for picnics. Okay, um, I got more garlands. I got a pie garland. They're like all different pies. They're all different pies. How cute is that? A pumpkin garland with little puff, puff puffs on it. And a leaf garland. I think this is the last of the, like, item garlands. I got leaf garlands, which I usually put these under things instead of over things. I think I'm going to put them under, like, all the TVs. A little mushroom. It's, like, fake woven little mushroom. Mini pumpkins. I did not realize how many this pumpkin was. Okay, that's a real mini pumpkin. Just stray leaves. I like to use these for content. That's everything in the basket. I love the basket, it's so cute. Another boucle pumpkin. I think I'm gonna do like pumpkins like sticking out of it like this. I'm so excited. More vase, folly vase inserts. More garlands for leaf stuff. More leaf garlands, more leaf garlands. I really liked the color of these. We have so much space to cover. We have like so many TVs we can put garlands under. Azula. What are you doing, on? Get out of here. Okay, and another not fall specific thing that I was really excited about is this. It's like a little freaking like harvest basket. A mushroom candle. Baby versions of the mushroom candles. Apple candles. What? Apple candles. And then another little pumpkin. I think I'm gonna decorate with what I have and then see if there's like missing pieces or there's like empty spots. And then the Michaels and Home Goods in World Market will happen if needed. It's so much bigger than the other places I've decorated that I'm not used to what I actually need. I got both of these yesterday at Target. And this, I'm so excited. How cute are these coasters? Someone sent them to me. It's Niche, N-E-E-S-H underscore co. And she like hand burns these little coasters. I love them. Oh, this is the other fall thing I got was these little thumb grips. Also Amazon, so cute. And I got some other leaf ones and I also got, y'all are gonna laugh at me, but the girls that get it, okay? I got an acorn sunny angel for Halloween. Okay. I'm just gonna start by um, unpacking everything just so that I can see what I'm working with. 
And then I think I'm gonna go room by room rather than like item by item. Start with this room because this is where I film the most content and this is where I am the most, so I want it to look cute. everything laid out these are all of the garlands those are all of the like vase sticky things all of the ready to go decor over here all of the candles lined up here and then some more pumpkins up there and then all of my pumpkin pillows and some basket stuff over here so that's everything and then i have the cookies on the floor <laughs> i am gonna get started on decorating We back, we back, okay. We need to fill in some of the gaps, okay? There were some gaps to fill. So world market it is. I have too many stirrups and not enough pumps, so I always get one of these. Mr. World Market really showed up this year because these little felted pears, oh my God, so cute. All of the little pumpkin decor, little mushroom decor, little foresty creatures, so freaking cute. I really had to just hone in on what I was actually missing and all of the blank spaces and not just go crazy here. So I was just getting what I needed, which was more pumpkins and that's it. And not this little basket of forest creatures, felted forest creatures that I really, I was really tempted to get, um, but I did not, I didn't do it. I'm so good. This stuff is so cute. I feel like this section is like the epitome of what world market is just any season cute food cute home stuff charming adorable they know what the people want and they give it to you i ended up putting that back by the way <laughs> i didn't need it this is so cute look how cute the little mushroom stools i love them oh, hello gorgeous i wouldn't get it but i like it it's cute this little wreath section little food section the food here goes crazy especially the seasonal food got this because why, why wouldn't I, please? Little pie filling and pie trays, so cute. I don't need them though, I don't bake. These little mushroom doodads and the little chicken coop cookie jar, so cute. They had some cute pumpkin candles, but I went for the acorn candles because I hadn't seen anything like this before. It's so cute, I love it. World Market always gets me on the drinks. I always walk out with some drinks I don't need, but listen, this tea, I feel like I needed this. Listen, hear me out, hot apple cider tea, apple pie chai where are you finding apple pie chai nowhere except world market hey yo and then monin had this little set fall autumn harvest collection syrups are you kidding me cinnamon bun there's like an apple one. Oh my god the apple one tastes like apple crisp from starbucks i'm just truly in heaven here like look at this stuff look at this stuff it's so cute and they had little bath bombs little maple leaf and a little pumpkin the pumpkin 
it really looked like a pumpkin, but I still got it, okay? And that was all from World Market. Now, on to Home Goods, Home Goods, Home Goods. That's me snapping in the mic, Home Goods. Immediately saw this, put it in the cart. Like, first thing, I walked in, saw this in the cart. Home Goods usually kind of has this needle in the haystack vibe, but this, they were, they had a lot of, this was a good ratio. This was about 50-50. You were finding a cute thing to like a wild, well, why is this here thing? Like this, this huge tall pumpkin. I wanted that so bad, but it was, it was just me. I wouldn't have cared. It was heavy. I couldn't have carried it to my car. And then they had these cute Halloween decorations. But again, I'm not ready for Halloween yet. I'm just, I can't even look at Halloween stuff fully. I'm not ready, but it was so cute. This little like trick or treat bag. Look at it, look at it. It's so cute. It's like punch embroidery. Okay, one of the gaps I realized I had was like dish towels because I thought we had a bunch because usually I buy a lot of stuff I don't need, but I don't, I didn't have any. So I wanted to get this pair and then I saw this cute little one. I was like, ooh, maybe I should get this one instead, but it's not a pair. So then I would have to get two to get two of the same pair. You know what I'm saying? So I just got this one because it's two of the same, which is what I want. This aisle was just gorgeous. Look at her, gorgeous. But I had already got a wreath, so I didn't need any of these syrups. I saw pumpkin pie syrup. I did get pumpkin spice syrup already, but pumpkin pie is different. So is almond roca. Okay, I needed both of these. I won't explain myself. These little cups were cute, little, little Charlie Brown ones, so cute. Then I got scheming on the dining table. So I saw these pumpkin placemats and I was like, yeah, yes, yes, I need these. And then I saw these, which are little napkin rings. And I was like, I don't even have napkins, but we already have the pumpkin thing, so I need it. And then I found napkins. And these are not seasonally tied napkins. So I feel like that's a good investment, little linen napkins. Then I just saw, I don't know, I need, I didn't need it actually, but it's cute and it's autumn -y, so I got it. Okay, that's all from Home Goods. It actually wasn't that much. Oh, and then I got this little dish drying mat. But that's all. Yay! Now for Michaels, Michaels, Michaels. Uh, uh, Michaels, Michaels, Michaels. I got some hay. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let's go. Y'all, I almost did a spit take when I saw this. Look at the price. A hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. And it's fifty percent off, but still that's fifty dollars for this. Uh uh. No. No. Uh-uh, it's cute, not that cute. Bye, next. Garlands, so many garlands. I got like 10 of these, not really. I think I got like five. Cause we needed more garlands for everything. I realized we have a lot of space, we need garlands. This little flower area was just so cute. I didn't actually get anything from it, but it's so pretty, look how pretty. I got some pumpkins, sure did, sure did, sure did. I got like five, I think, maybe even six. I got a lot of pumpkins. I like these though, cause they look realistic and I like the more realistic looking pumpkins. And I had a vision for the hay bale and I needed a lot of pumpkins for that. Then I saw this as a little, little centerpiece thing. I thought it'd be cute in the dining table. And then I saw this, I had to get another one in white. Cause I have the one in orange, but I didn't see the white one online. So I got that and they have these really cute plates, but I don't need them when it used them, but they were just cute. I want to show y'all look at the little pumpkin. It's so cute. And they have some cute lighting stuff. Listen, if Michael's had cuter shelving, they would give Target a run for their money because this stuff is really cute, but it just looks less cute because it's on this kind of industrial shelving. I'm telling y'all, if they had some good staging, this stuff, people would be going crazy in the in the Michaels of the world. And they had a lot of cute Halloween stuff also. So much cute Halloween stuff. I feel like Michaels is the place to go for Halloween stuff, period. But again, not looking at Halloween stuff. Wreaths, garlands, very cute. A little, a little, a lot. A little, a lot, <laughs> but they're cute. Okay, this is all I got from Michaels. It's just a lot of pumpkins and hay bales, basically. We did that, besties. We did that. Look at that car packed full. Ah, oh, so proud of us. Okay, all the shopping is completely done, like completely done. I will not be leaving the house for any more fall shopping, okay? The last day, um, World Market, Home Goods, Michaels was a lot. It was, a, it was a lot. I just, I cannot stress that enough. Nobody needs as many pumpkins as I just got, okay? Basically what I'm gonna do is show y'all how I've decorated because I pretty much got everything where I want it. Um, except for in here actually, in here it's a little in flux just because I've, I have to move stuff around a lot for, for like filming stuff. And I've been filming a lot of TikToks lately, so. But so right now, I have the little, I have the hobbies and stuff over there that's not gonna be there. And then I have the plushies that I'm gonna be sending to y'all eventually. I have this little basket with the sunflowers. I have a little pumpkin. I put a garland under this TV, a little felt pumpkin that I had, little mushroom from Primark, the dark pumpkin, and then the light pumpkin candle there. I put this over there. The white 
I was just laying here, so it's a little <laughs> squished, but I put the white pumpkin pillow there, this there. I have the blanket draped over here and the magazine there. A little smattering of pumpkins there. This is this final little setup. I really like this over here, the, the Target one. I got this from Home Goods, Amazon. Also Amazon, the candlestick, and I'm gonna paint those. And then we have this little more neutral setup over here. And then I just put um, all these little felted guys from the garland that I had last year. I just cut them off because it was too tangled. Put those there, put some pumpkins there. I got this one from Target um online though so that's why we didn't get it at the store this guy from target here my desk over here i have set up like this on my desk and that's kind of all i have also i'm in such a like fall outfit right now because i was doing a fay farm stream and i was dressing as a fairy <laughs> so i had little fairy wings and stuff still have my little fairy outfit i really like it and i have little raspberry earrings but let me show you elsewhere and i'll do a voiceover because we have stuff happening all, all around the house. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute with the blinds closed. So we have a little pumpkin wreath there. And then we put a little pumpkin over here, little stuff. <laughs> We're gonna wrap these around the railing. So that's gonna be outside, we haven't done that yet. Oh, I see that. I see the boy. <laughs> hey, Bubba. It's so cute. Look at you in the corner. Okay, in the kitchen we have this. It's like a little maple leaf garland. And then like, this is the thing I got from Home Goods. We have our little dish towels from Home Goods. Oh, the scones from World Market. And then over here, I really like this little area. A little garland back there. We did some pumpkins. And a little pear right there. Oh, and then these. Yeah, the cats kept knocking these off the table, but cute little the napkins with the... I got syrup on this. Okay, ignore that. With the little pumpkin napkin holders. How cute is this? So that's the kitchen. The kitchen's like my second favorite room, probably. Bye, Chila. Then in the bedroom, I just put this here. That's kind of all I did because I, I'm not, I don't like the bedroom to be like too folly, mainly because my other room is like super folly. So we just put this in the bedroom. Okay, we did the little pear and the little vase insert over here. And then we added some little pumpkins, some little fall florals, garlands, the glass pumpkins over here. Loving the little glass candle, glass pumpkin together over here. A little apple candle, little garland on the fireplace, little garlands underneath the TV, more face inserts and then outside is one of my favorite parts look at this <gasps> so cute this is my vision come to life here it is my baby my child i love it it's like a mini pumpkin patch okay y'all that's everything that is everything that we used with all the stuff we bought it was so much fun taking y'all with me this year usually i just have like this euphoric experience by myself fall shopping but it was much more fun doing it with y'all because y'all are my accomplices now you're my partners in crime okay it was just so much fun and i just am so excited to like be in that corner be in that corner just read my fall magazines and play my fall games and do all my fall hobbies and i'm so excited that's it y'all i just know i can't you just tell i'm beaming i'm so happy i love fall and i love all the fall decor we put up together i'm gonna take y'all out with a full tour of the finished place so y'all get the whole dealio okay i love you stay cozy and have a lovely fall bye